This is where we hang them, isn't it? They broke into the police station, tried to burn the register so the Germans wouldn't know which kids to take. We didn't want the Germans to be angry, did we? We were so scared, or maybe just so tired, so we hanged them to encourage the others. I wonder if we'd made the Germans take the kids by force instead of bringing them down to the station singing London Bridge if things would be different now. <gasps> <coughs> I hope that's the worst thing I remember, says the chap heading to the train station. Oh, what lovely memories are waiting for me there. At least I can get on the train tracks there and get the hell out of town. No, I just need to find the train station. I want to be able to see it from a distance. At least there are flowers out here. Clothes make the man, don't they? Nobody likes a naked person. Thank you all for playing. Did we say cook us a plate of shite tasting grub? No. We told you fucking meat and potatoes tasting food, you stupid bitch. My God, they've kidnapped some poor woman. I could be a real hero and rescue her. Or get myself killed. I can't take it anymore. I can't take it. Oh, God, meat and potatoes. Please don't make a fuss. Help me! They want meat and potatoes. I can't make meat and potatoes at the bunkers and leave. It's just not possible. I'm not an alchemist. I could make a beautiful souffle if you gave me eggs and butter. But who's got eggs and butter? They want meat and potatoes. You have to go. They'll come back. They'll come back and they'll do terrible things to you.
Nothing much to fuss about, I guess. It's not you, it's me. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Come back any time, I'll make you something fantastic! My savior! Here, I've been cooking, taste this. What do you think? Yummy, isn't it? Well, to drop by someday when I'm in the neighborhood. Stew would be nice, even if it is made out of fungus and leaves. I think this might be the one Sally and me tried to blow up. I always wondered what happened to the letters. There was an awful lot of smoke. Didn't we go to school together? I think this is the fountain Sally and I put the fish in. We were witty in those days. It could be worse. I think. I'd better not catch you getting into my stuff. Get your own bloody pump. Leave my friend alone. You can't kill all of us. You can have your cake and then eat it too. Who's the parent? And here we are. Not quite as grand as it used to be. Of course, there hasn't been a train since the germs left. Still, the tracks go from here all the way to the bridge and then across the river. And then all over Britain. I wonder if Prue made it this far. I wonder why Mr. Kite sent her to the Garden District at all. She could have just popped over the bridge from the station at Apple Hole. What are we going to do if there isn't food? Will you shut it? I'm trying not to blow myself up. Hey, lock up your ball bags, I'll piss in your corpses. We're coming for you, you greedy bastard! Go eat a banger, you leaky scanner! You're done hoarding all the bee meat! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <gasps> oh, it's nothing. <sighs> Don't struggle.
It's better this way. Won't hurt a bit. How do I get down to the tracks? Just relax. Don't question it. That's how I get down. Right. Huh. Now I just have to find the tracks and walk on out of Wellington Wells. I'm so sorry, Percy. I should have got on the train with you, like I promised. The rule was if a kid was a day over 13, what could I do? You could have kept your mouth shut, Arthur, and not told them you were 13. That's what you could have done.
just uh, watching the day go by. Too old to go to Germany, are you not? Bloody Bobby. I told him I wanted to board even if I was ten days too old, but we don't make the rules anymore, Mr. Hastings. I shouldn't have told him they got my birthday wrong. Don't even know why I did. Should have just kept quiet and got on the train. some sort of caving. So much for walking down the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. What the fuck do I do now? Oh, look! It's a little lost lamb. Where's Bo Peep? In your curtsy way, I bet. <laughs> That's little Miss Muppet, you Muppet. Uh, 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 can we pound him now? Yep. Ah! Cyprus! Over! I see never wrong about a thing like that. Remember the 5th of November! Remember the 5th of November! Don't eat V-Meat! Ah! <laughs> 
Ah! It's not personal. If I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. this with you. Bloody hell. That's Ollie. Ollie! Come for me, have you? Ollie? I'm Arthur! You won't get me! You won't get me, you bastard! Ollie! No! It's Arthur! Bloody 
murdering wastrels. Are you going mental? I'll save you, Margaret. I'm your old neighbour, Artie. Oh, he's lying. Little Artie. Artie's gone. They took him away. Ollie, no, they You're didn't. You're lying. You're a wastrel. Ollie, it's Arthur. Well, why didn't you see that before? Oh my god, Artie. Little Artie. Yeah, for fuck's sake. Watch your mouth, laddie. What would your mum think? I thought they took you away. No. They had my birthday wrong. What? Sorry? No, of course not. No, you've got it all wrong. That was Jack turned you in and I what tried to save you. Right. I remember now. You came back. From the station. The only one. You don't think they hurt him? Percy. The Germans aren't animals, you know. They just wanted to make sure we stay quiet. And we did. Spot of tea? Uh, that's very kind of you. I I'm not thirsty. That's right, Margaret. We have to run after water. <laughs> I have to find him. Any idea where he might be after all these years? Not really. I know I have to get out of Wellington Wells. I, th I thought I could take the train tracks to the bridge. Aye. The only way to the Britannia Bridge is the train station and the parade. And good luck getting into the parade. <laughs> you could stay here. Remember when you and Sally used to stay with me? When the... It's young Artie. Meg, you remember Artie, don't you? No room at the inn for young Artie? No. You're right. You're always right. Sorry. Margaret says it's best if I keep to myself. Oh. Sorry to bother. But... Margaret thinks we could help each other. Really? Uh, brilliant! There's a warehouse. In the old German camp, we could burgle it. The Victory Memorial Camp? Where all those home army chaps run around practicing stabbing people with bayonets? What, what do you want me to do there? Run around yelling, here I am, shoot me, while you go in under the wire? There's uh, a thing I need from their warehouse. If you help me, I'll get you out of Wellington Wells. I just need you to turn off the power in the camp. And this isn't going to get me killed. Don't be a great girl's blouse. I'll meet you at the bunker after dark. Don't worry about the sentries on the bridge. I'll make sure they get a good night's sleep. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. Shall I just show myself out then? Ollie? I don't actually know the way out, you know. That's Margaret. From school. Margaret... What's her name? She was supposed to go on the train, but then she disappeared and no one would talk about it. when I grew up. I can't remember. Isn't that awful? This is for the benefit of Mr. Kite. The rabbit got into the garden. The rabbit got into the garden. Sounds like some sort of secret message.
You rubbish, your art and seek, aren't you? <laughs> Sorry to bother. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. Mother would be so proud. I wish I kept in shape. Oof. You two bloody listen to me, all right? One fine day, the sea boys come running into the regimental HQ, saying there's an elephant broke loose. Now, elephants is very gentle creatures most of the time, and they get along just fine with their man who rides. He's called a moo. But when they're in heat, you have to chain them up. And this one, they got loose. And his moo went chasing off in exactly the wrong direction. And the elephant runs into the market and starts eating peaches. And the coolie tries to stop him. And the elephant oh, steps on him something horrible. Mashes him right into the mud and skin comes off his back like he was peeling a grape. So the sea boys come running up to this general. Only then, he was a major, and say, you must come shoot this elephant. So, he takes his hunting rifle, and he goes down to the market. The elephant isn't in the market anymore. It's in a field eating leaves. It's calm as never mind. There's no cause to shoot it anymore. And by now the moon's come back and he's screaming and jabbering about, oh, please don't shoot my elephant. You see, he's gone up with it. You can't go on it. They said I could. Well, of course the Germans said you could go on it. I'm saying you can't. I've never been on a battleship. But that's not the point. We hate the Germans, and that battleship is part of the reason the Germans are our lords and masters right now. Do you remember when they came over in all the little boats? Do you mean in 1942 or in 1943? Do you want people to spit on Mum when she goes to the market? She doesn't go to the market. 
since 1945. Well, look, this is just one of those things. I can't explain every single detail of everything to you. Are you mad at me? I'm not. You're not? I mean, yes, I am. I am mad. I was mad, but now I'm not. Look, please don't go on the Bismarck. It will get you into trouble, which means I'll then be in trouble. All right. You won't go? I couldn't go without you, anyway. For once, that's a relief. And he don't know how to do any other job except sit on that elephant and tell it to pick up a log and carry it over there. But the elephant's taking the life of a man, you see. Coolly, but a man. And the moon's crying and jabbering. Cool as a summer breeze. The general chambers around. No fucking civilians! I have to kill you now. Christ. I better not let anyone see me out of uniform. Drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's going to be tediously slow going. Do you ever wonder why the Germans didn't take their tanks with them when they left? I've made a map. There's a hole in the fence, inside the dump. You just have to get in here, get the key, and cut the power. Then, sneak out into the darkness while I rob them blind. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. How do I cut the power? The General keeps the keys in his desk. You want me to break into the General's office? Any way you can scotch the power is fine by me, lad. I'll meet you back at the train station. What if they spot me? I'd run. They don't have a lot of ammunition, but they're terribly handy with their bayonets. That's your plan B? Run? Well, you could ask them for some of their famous hot buttered crumpets, but I wouldn't recommend it. They can't run very fast. They're all old farts, like me. Let's see that map you made. Hmm. Holy sleeping potion for those chaps on the bridge. <sighs> oh. Your move, Sam, man. <laughs> 